Hello, welcome to this new video where we are going to study the pronunciation of some words which have a French origin and end in a T, which is actually mute, es muda. So we have to be careful because these words um, have a T, but we don't pronounce it. And not all of them, but we're going to take a look at the ones that we don't pronounce a T and then the exceptions, okay? So let's take a look at these type of words. For example, bouquet, bouquet, okay, a uh, ramo de flores, a bouquet is un ramo de flores, okay, it comes from French, and therefore we pronounce a, or bidet, 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 you know, a toilet uh, in Spanish, mm, bidet, the same, or cabaret, cabaret, okay, cabaret, uh, is the same, we, we, we see a T, but we don't pronounce it or cache, 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 you know, the money that you get paid for, or the re reputation uh, that you have, uh, like an actor or, uh, you know, an artist. Uh, croquet, croquet uh, is the sport, you know, the, the game, which is actually, let me show you a picture of croquet, okay, this is with the mullet, you know, the mullet and the balls, and you play on the floor, obviously. Uh, don't don't get confused with um, with cricket, okay? Cri cricket, which is actually an exception, okay? Cricket is an exception, and let me let me show you a picture of cricket, okay? It's uh, similar to 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 baseball, okay? So, uh, but croquet is pronounced with uh, without the t, and cricket is pronounced with the t as an exception. Then uh, gourmet, okay, gourmet foods, it's the same, gourmet in Spanish. Ricochet, ricochet means uh, to rebound, rebotar, ricochet. Valet, valet, in this case, uh, both uh, valet and valet are, are accepted as pronunciation for the valet, the person who parks your car in a restaurant or in an event, the valet, the person in charge of parking your car. Okay, and then one word ending in UT, in UT, in UT, which is debut, okay, debut, okay, be careful, don't pronounce the T. And now let's take a look at those exceptions, like cricket or corset, 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 toilet, omelette, tortilla, omelette, okay, that, that you pronounce with a T. And also all the E, T, T, E endings, which obviously come from French, and they are pronounced with a T. Like croquette, croqueta, croquette, or baguette, or toilette, uh, vedette, vignette, vignetta, vignette, silhouette, silhouette, roulette, roulette, gazette, gazetta, etiquette, etiqueta. But be careful, etiquette. Is etiqueta in the sense of, uh, you know, like a social convention, okay, etiquette. Cigarette, brunette, which is a, a, una, el pelo, una mujer que tiene el pelo oscuro, a brunette. A brunette is, a, is, is the opposite of blonde. Then laundrette, laundrette, which is uh, lavandería, laundrette, and omelette, which can be spelled with E-T-T-E or without the T-E, okay? We, we have two spellings for amulet. Now, all of these words are French, so be very careful because then there are many words that are always pronounced with T, like budget or market or magnet or pocket, quiet, target, jacket, secret, rocket, ticket. Okay, all of these words, you know, they have different origins and they don't come necessarily from French, French, so be very careful, okay? So remember, basically these are the, the words that you have to remember about bouquet, bidet, cabaret, cachet, gourmet, ricochet, valet, and debut, okay? Not, not pronouncing with a T. Okay, so this is all for the words that we pronounce without the T and that come from French. Thanks very much, and I'll see you in the next video.